I went to Taco Bell and I got recognized by the person in the drive-thru, but I still had to pay. <laughs> Boss guys. <laughs> Can I just tell you how thankful I am for these vibrating electronic razor things? You don't have to put anything on your face and you can talk and vlog while you should- Ah! Ah! I'm just kidding. No, but like you don't have to use freaking- Can you imagine having to use shaving cream? That sucks a bunch of donkeys. <laughs> I don't know what that phrase means, but I might be going to jail in Singapore. Lots of stuff is illegal in Singapore. Oh, you saw me in the back. You saw me in the freaking meal. I didn't even, that didn't even work. I don't care. If you're in Singapore, you better make plans to go to jail because everyone freaking goes. Hold on. Let me make, actually make sure that's a fact and it's not just a thing I just made up. The crime rate in Singapore is one of the lowest in the world. Yeah, right. Selling chewing gum is freaking forbidden, dude, because people shove it underneath the thing, the rails, the subway. A lot of bad breath in Singapore. <laughs> I mean, unless they brush their teeth. They probably brush their teeth. I don't actually chew gum. Elevators in Singapore are equipped with urine detection devices, and if you pee in an elevator, you go to jail. The elevator door locks, and you can't get out until the cops get there. <laughs> know what else is illegal in Singapore? Being gay. Sorry, David. You go to jail for two years. I don't know why David, dude. I don't know why I said David. It starts with a D, ends with a D. It's a cool name. It starts and ends with a D. <laughs> I don't know what that means. I have glasses on. If you are caught not flushing a toilet, you get fined $150. You gotta flush the toilet. They don't detect that you don't flush the toilet though. They detect it in the freaking elevator. It is also illegal to walk around your house naked. So, I mean, you just can't not have, you have to have clothes on uh, or else you get arrested. What are they gonna do, come in your house and then arrest you while you're naked and then what? Were they gonna put clothes on you first? How are you ever gonna get out of jail if it's illegal to be naked and they arrest you while you're naked? You got nothing to do after that. Do not spit anywhere. If you spit in Singapore, you go to jail and they enforce that. If you, if they see you spitting, you're gonna see yourself inside of prison. If you take drugs in the country or before you even enter the country, you can get the death sentence. If you have opium, morphine, diamorphine, cocaine, cannabis, or methamphetamine, you get killed. They kill you. They murder you. Well, one country's legal drug, another country's mandatory death sentence. That's why the crime rate is so low, because they kill everybody off. It says even if you have the keys to a house that has any sort of drug in it, you are you have the drug in your possession. So if somebody's like, hey, can you hold my keys for a sec? Be like, no, I want to live. I had an amazing day. I went hiking oh, and I was like, oh, this sucks. So I stopped. But uh, I mean, yeah, I did it. I still, I would still say I went hiking. I, went, I didn't finish the course, but you know, like when you go and then you're like, oh, it goes up and then you're like, ah, there's my car. That's what happened. It was good though. Uh, so I, I met up with uh, my friend Miles. Uh, <laughs> that's ironic, Miles. He didn't want to go on the hike. But his name is Miles though, which is a mess up on his parents' part. But uh, we actually went to a comedy show, laughed. I laugh really loud, always. If you, if I'm ever at anything with you at, in a theater or of some sort, you know, I'm like, <laughs> always, just not, nonstop. And it, you know, it might get annoying, but like, I think a lot, of, you know, I think stuff's funny. I don't know. Uh, and it's a good workout to laugh. It makes your life longer. Just laugh, you know. If I get a joke, sometimes I'll laugh. 